Hey everyone, this is Chris, Pipe Man Now, doing another video here. Um, one of them is to promote a style of pipes that I've really learned to love, and that's the Church Warden. This. First of all, the music you're listening to is by a group called Fleet Foxes. This is Ragged Wood, the song. Highly recommend group. Great listening to. Great listening to if you're reading or smoking up. Great listening to if you're reading or smoking a pipe or doing both. So, as I said, um, this is going to be about church wardens. And I'm going to be reading a uh, tobacco that I haven't smoked in a while. And first of all, the pipe I'm going to be smoking is this Bjorn. You can't really see the. Yeah, there it is. It's a panel Bjorn church warden. Bjorns are handmade pipes made in Denmark starting in 1973. Unfortunately, uh, Bjorn Nielsen, uh, the founder of the company, uh, died in February 2008, and I don't believe the pipes are being made anymore. So whatever inventory there is, is out there. So anyway, so there's the pipe. The tobacco I'm going to be smoking is the Clellan's Blackwoods Flake. It's Virginia. It's a whole lot of Virginia. Um, the natural sweetness of mellow red Virginias and the richness and inherently spicy aroma of stove black Virginias combine in this beautiful mottled flake. Yeah, that's right, it's a flake. So you're gonna have to rub it out some. Take a couple minutes out of your life. It's worth it. This is great tobacco. Uh, very spicy. This, this smells like a, uh, almost a pine forest, but only very earthy. Anyway. I already rubbed some out. When it rubs out, it looks like that. Quite excellent stuff. Um, I kind of got interested in the church warden shape, even as a child. Um, I was a child. I was 12 years old when I first read Lord of the Rings. One of the biggest reasons why I smoke a pipe is because of Lord of the Rings. That's right, geek. Pile on top of that, my Sherlock Holmes uh, stories I loved reading as a kid, and well, whammo. There was just no way I wasn't going to be a pipe smoker. Um, some of you newer guys out there may have seen these around, may have seen them in pipe shops. Uh, church wardens can come in different shapes, sizes, whatnot, but uh, the cool thing about church wardens is that their long stem uh, really allows you to have a really cool smoke. Seriously, this is one of my coolest smoking pipes. And it's quite good. And what's great about this particular church, church warden is really thick bulb. It's got a nice hole there and whatnot, but I mean, I can smoke the heck out of this. Alright, I think I got it. And a uh, little Grey Goose vodka. We're good to go. Let's see if I can do this right. I've never. Try to like this on camera before. Ah, oh, this is so rich. You know, for anyone who may be smoking aromatics right now and thinking that's the only thing for you, I gotta tell you, these Red Virginias just offer so much taste and whatnot. Um, I just can't say enough about it. Ah, yes. Ah, the first, the overwhelming sensation when you first smoke this is how spicy this tobacco is. I mean, seriously spicy. And it's still quite moist.
That's my cat Gandalf you hear in the background. Again, Lord of the Ring reference, right? Ah, this is just amazing tobacco. Uh, I love Virginia's once it's gotten cooler here in Arizona. And as you can see, it's you get plenty of smoke from a church warden. And it's so cool. Um, I like to uh, puff on this pipe when I'm reading. I play World of Warcraft. Yeah, I know. Another geek thing, right? So, so this is not really a pipe good for that. I have other pipes I can hold my mouth while I do this. I can blow smoke rings. I just can't blow a ship like they did in the movie. You know, this is this stuff is so smooth and so rich. You you, you I almost keep waiting for a tongue bite, and, uh, and nothing's going to happen. Uh, deep, rich Virginias, um, you just can't beat them. Man, I don't know why I waited so long to smoke this stuff again. It's excellent. I know a few of you of my friends I've spoken to on, on Skype and whatnot have church wardens. And I know some people out there don't like them. I think Pipe Friend doesn't like them. I mean, it's, it's not easy to carry this around. This is obviously a, you know, at my house kind of thing. And um, I do recommend you get the, the very long pipe cleaners for this. That way you clean the whole stem. This is just so smooth, so rich. <clears throat> Actually gets me a little lightheaded. That's not counting the alcohol. That was just my first few sips of that. And I've seen a lot of different variety of styles of church wardens out there on the internet to, to you know to shop for. Um, they're not the most common things. I hardly ever see one on eBay. But it's just effortless smoking this thing. And this never even gets very warm. And I'm a big time puffer. And I feel like Gandalf right now. I think the hobbits would sm be smoking Virginia's. That's the closest thing to Hobbit weed I can think of. Mm. This is so good. You can drink, you know, you can you can drink coffee with this or whatever you like. Um, I would think it'd be great. Or hot tea. I'm a big fan of hot tea. But yeah, if you haven't tried Virginia's yet, you know, I recommend the McClellan's blends always but you know go to your local pipe shop if you're lucky enough to have one in your town and uh, and check them out again you have to rub up the flake a little bit but it's so worth it anyway I just wanted to do the review again it's Blackwood flake I'm smoking church word church warden pipes I think they're way cool Leave your comments, rate it, and I appreciate you watching. Cheers.